All right, guys, so we're back. We are in the shop and it's cold. It's raining, it's been raining for three days now. Or, did I say three days? Three weeks, ha, huh. nuts. So we're working on wings, wings to go on our dragonfly. So we just cut a piece of cottonwood out. We're gonna make this guy bigger because we want two wings to be small, two wings to be big, right? So I'm gonna bring it down. All I'm doing is I'm just gonna shape them up and then we'll attach them. Alright guys, so that's a wing. Um, as you can see, the dragonfly body, it will be, well, can't really see that very well I guess, but it's gonna go in there like that, okay? So, we're just trying to keep it to the same kind of not the same design because these are two different wings, right? The two wings that are smaller are the same design and then the two wings that are bigger will be the same design for themselves. Um, Given a little bit of curves, that's all we're gonna do. Next step we're going to do is we're going to insert our wings into our dragonfly. So what we need to do is take a little bit, very tiny, and dig a little groove in there. So let's try that. small enough but not too thin to get them into the Alright, so we're going to do one side at a time, as you can see. Um, because what we did is we drilled the holes in, we added our wings in, and we added glue, and then we're just going to throw some sawdust on the top and uh, it'll take a bit to dry but we'll do the other ones we got the other two wings here uh i just don't want to uh, i don't want to push into them i can't do the last one because it's too much of an angle if this one i want enough pressure to stay in there because what we're going to do okay what well, we got three wings in the fourth one we're going to wait for um when it's all solid and dried, what we're going to do is we're going to paint and then we're going to add epoxy on it so that it stays solid, okay? So, uh, we're going to set this guy aside. Just put him down. Hopefully he doesn't fall over or nothing. Um, and then we're still working on her hand. What we did was we kind of brought it down a bit more. Um, the thumb, this corner, I think what I did was I put too much of an angle in it, but it still looks, I mean, from this angle... I think we're okay, so we're just going to sand it down and see what happens. We're going to see what happens um, with the dragonfly, obviously, and with our hand. I think it's looking pretty good. Just needs a little bit of sanding. Um, still, again, haven't contacted my buddy, the guy who, or the, the guy who ordered this. To find out what he wants to do with the hand, if he wants it painted or just left, left like this. Um, I think our next, what we're going to do is, okay, we're just going to sand this down. And what I'd like to do is take the, the razor tip, our wood burner, all right, and we're just going to add a little bit of darkness to our hand. Now, after we've done that. Uh, we just give it a little bit of a sand so it doesn't look like it's too burnt. And we're just going to set that up in a couple of seconds. All right. <coughs> Make 
so Burner here. Let's bring it down. We're just using a normal rounded tip. Nothing fancy. We use that we use this for the scaling, which is fine. Turn around and get it hot. And what I'm trying to do here is just give it a little bit of burning inside of the fingers. To make it so you could see that there is sort of like a nail involved there. I did carve out that portion so you could see that there's a nail. But what we're going to do is we're going to add some darkness to it, just like this. So that we have it like so you can see um, a nail all right so we'll continue with these for the other four digits like so keep on going. <clears throat> Alright guys, so we did the fingers, we did a little bit of this um, and inside the hand so you can see where it is. It's a little bit darker, that's fine because uh, once we put like the epoxy on it and the stain, they'll go into it. So still waiting for these bad guys to dry, then I got a third, fourth one to put on and then he will be sitting on there like that and then we'll paint. So that will be the next uh, video. We'll upload this one and see what happens. Alright guys, keep on watching.